I'm Stephen Harrison, the Curator of Decorative Art and Design at the Cleveland Museum of Art, and I'm the Curator of the Jazz Age, American Style in the 1920s. This is an exhibition that chronicles uh, the wonderful era of design in the 1920s, a dazzling era of flappers and dandies and uh, magnificent artwork from this period. We're standing next to one of the icons of the exhibition and of the decade, uh, Victor Schreckengass jazz bowl, or as he called it, the New Yorker. Uh, he designed it in 1929 as a result of a commission from Eleanor Roosevelt for her husband's second inaugural uh, as governor of the state of New York. She didn't know where it was being designed from. She had asked for it from a New York gallery, but they called uh, the Cowan Pottery in Cleveland, Ohio, where Victor Schreckengast uh, was one of the chief designers at the time and he designed this bowl reflecting the sights and sounds of New York City at night. The 1920s was really an era of amazing change and contrast. Uh, for women, it was really a decade of, of, of uh, new beginnings and new freedoms. Uh, they had been thrust into the workplace and during the First World War, and by 1920, suddenly, they had the right to vote. So uh, they smoked and danced and uh, threw off their corsets, bobbed their hair, and uh, worked during the day and became flappers at night. And we have shown in this gallery uh, some of the most wonderful uh, examples of flapper fashion from the 1920s, most of it uh, worn right here in Cleveland uh, during the era. Modern design was a hallmark of the 1920s, especially the latter part of the decade, uh, which led to what was known as the machine age to come in the 1930s. Uh, this magnificent machine, uh, the cord, uh, made in Auburn, Indiana in 1937, dominates the final gallery in the Jazz Age exhibition. And it reflects the, uh, the love of speed and aerodynamics that designers began to embody uh, automobiles with in, at the end of the, the decade. It looks forward in design. It's no longer a horseless carriage. It looks forward to the future. <laughs>